getting a like. Every time I get on there, I give you videos likes. Hey, everybody. Look who I got here in the driver's seat of this. This puke Nissan Titan. What I got here is one of my buddies, uh, Shadow Kills, Kills, K I L Z, or K I L L Z, Kills Games. Uh, he plays video games on YouTube or whatever. What is it that you do? I live stream video games. Oh, and when he does, I make fun of him. <laughs> so, if y'all like to watch gaming stuff like that or into that, check out his channel. And uh, when you do, don't cut him no slack. <laughs> so, we are on our way to Royal King to pick up a a new piece of I won't call it equipment. Uh, it's it's a sprayer. So that's that's what that's what we're doing. And he uh, he didn't like my Ford Moco, Ford Moco, as some people say. So we got stuck in the. Uh, Japanese Nissan 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 Titan <laughs> So anyways stay tuned and we'll catch you a little later I tell you what I sure hope it'll haul it okay He's already made the comment that he could feel how heavy it is it only weighs like 110 pounds It's already uh Killing the power of the truck. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, let's hope we make it home in one piece. Nah, I can't. Um, <laughs> it's actually a lot cheaper than I thought it was going to be. It's a $300 sprayer, 10 foot spray boom, 40 gallon capacity, uh, has a wand. Was it 2.2 gallon mm -hmm. pump? 2.2 yeah. gallon. So I mean, it should do what I want to do. Um, it's I'm gonna use it mainly to control brush. I mean, I am gonna you know maybe do some burn downs for corn. Um, you know, small acreage. But uh, if I do any large acreage of corn, I would have the company come and do it their with their machines because it's like thirty dollars an acre for them to do it. So anyways, uh, we'll get home and I'll get it put together and I'll let y'all see what it looks like. So we'll catch you a little later. Alrighty. Um, let me back up here, Gracious. There it is all put together. Um, I really don't have much to say about it, really. Other than... Um, I don't know. We'll see after I use it. Um, here's the booms. It comes somewhat pre-assembled. And I more or less had to redo it all. Because they had these on. And they were pointing straight up in the air. These springs here. And this eye hook is on this side. And there was something else. In this boom. What are these? No? Anyways, I don't forgot now. Um, they come pre assembled somewhat, but it wasn't. To ever put together, just ho hummed it. Let's see, did I tighten? Yeah, I tightened that up. Um, three point hitch, as you can see right here. It's a pin on each side, and there's for your top link. Um, here's your hanger for your hose. Uh, for your. For your wand this uh, is a 10 foot cover spray it's supposed to cover 10 foot um, I'm guessing these nozzles are like a wide angle that it'll come out you know shoot out of the half tape yeah that's what it'll do um, it's got a it's electric pump uh, it's 2.2 gallon here is the pressure gauge it'll be you know, it'll be on that side because that's the side you're going to be on. Um, I'm assuming this turns it off and on. You know, to open and close the valve. And right here is your pressure control. Where my finger is right there. Um, this is where you fill it up. 
This is a 40 gallon. Um, let's see, another feature of it is the springs. If you hit something, it'll bring it back. They fold up. Like I say, you can see. Um, it's a 2.2 gallon GPM pump, electric pump. Um, I bought the adapter for my tractor. Uh, what comes with it is it plugs in right here and it's got like 10 foot of cord with uh, alligator teeth like alligator clamps or whatever you're going to call them like on the end of a jumper cable to hook up to a 12 volt battery but I bought the adapter that plugs into my to my big tractor the 6410 because it has a 12 volt plug in so that's probably what I will use if it will go in between the rows of corn because I've never used I, I don't know how it's set out I mean I could measure and find out but I do know that the 2020 will go in between the rows because when I had a flat tire in the rear it, I drove in between the rows or in between the lines where it planted the corn. So anyways, um, as I was saying, um, early, well, yesterday now, uh, with my buddy, he is Shadow, Shadow Kills Games. Um, I was just joking, I'll give him a hard time. He's, he's been a lifelong friend of mine heck, since kindergarten. So anyways, he's, he's a good fella and he, what are you doing? He, uh, I like to watch his gaming. I'm not a big gamer or anything. Very seldom do I ever play. But, you know, I like to, he does some, uh, farming game stuff, what have you. But anyways, thanks for watching. Um, feel free to comment, subscribe, and, uh, let me know what you think with a thumbs up or thumbs down soon. Or thumbs down. Or thumbs down. So stay tuned for next, for the, uh, Stay tuned for the next video. And uh, it'll probably be on this sprayer working, so stay tuned for things for watching.